Are you annoyed by the newest marksman hero, Ixia? In this experiment, we are going to show you which heroes could possibly counter Ixia. We will also show you which heroes she could counter. Here we are again with our experiments. We have our lovely lab rat, Valerie, to demonstrate some experiments on Ixia's skills against other heroes that could counter or perfectly work with her. Let's now test which heroes could Ixia counter with Ixia's second skill. Ixia's second skill has a knockback and also a pull plus a stun afterwards. Let's try if Ixia can cancel Farsa's ultimate skill. As you can see, the pull with stun cancelled Farsa's ultimate skill. Next, let's test it on the newly adjusted ultimate skill of Odeth. As you can see, Odette is immune from the pull with stun. She's also immune against the knockback from Ixia's second skill. I guess we can now consider Odette as almost on the same level with Gord's ultimate skill or maybe even better. Testing it against Tigreal's ultimate, we were able to stop him from sucking everyone. Even the knockback cancelled his casting. How about we test it against Lolita's ultimate skill? The pull with stun also cancelled her ultimate skill casting. How about against Gord's almighty ultimate skill? As you can see, Gord was just knockback, pulled, and stunned but it didn't cancel his ultimate skill. He just continued puking rainbows like an adult with hangover. Let's now test which heroes could cancel Ixia's ultimate skill. During her ultimate skill's duration, she enters the barrage state that does not let her move. Let's try if silence could cancel Ixia's ultimate skill. As you can see, Natalia's silence didn't stop Ixia's ultimate skill. Same happened against Akai's ultimate skill. Although, she can't deal any attacks while being pushed away from Akai's life. How about testing it against the push from Tigreal's second skill? Ixia was just pushed but her ultimate is still intact. Even the knockup from Tigreal's second skill didn't cancel Ixia's ultimate skill at all. Trying it against Nana's second skill, Ixia was transformed but her ultimate skill was still not cancelled. I just don't feel Ixia will be taken seriously by her enemies while in this cute form. How about against the pro hooker, Franco? As you can see, Ixia was pulled towards Franco but her ultimate skill is still active. I think Ixia's ultimate skill is considered one of the ultimate skills in game that doesn't get cancelled easily. When we tested it out on Franco's ultimate skill, her ultimate skill got cancelled. That's because Franco's tight hug here has suppression effect. Testing it against Ka Jaw's ultimate skill, her ultimate skill was cancelled because it has suppression and she was dragged away. I know you've been waiting for this. So let's now test Ixia against heroes that could possibly counter her. Ixia's ultimate skill could let you see enemies from inside the bush. So how about let's test what would happen if Ixia uses her ultimate skill against heroes with invisibility. Testing it against Natalia's invisibility, she was revealed and is also targetable. Even the invisibility from Mia's ultimate skill was shown as bright as day within Ixia's ultimate skill. I bet Ixia could even hit ghosts with this. Testing her ultimate skill against Karina's first skill, Karina is immune from the basic attack barrage but I think you also noticed something funny. Karina is supposed to return back the projectiles from basic attacks back to the attacker but not on this scenario. I guess basic attacks from the attack barrage are just considered loose projectiles coming from nobody. We also tested Natalia's smoke screen which supposedly makes your basic attacks miss inside the smoke, and it definitely works against Ixia's ultimate skill. Last, but not the least, we have the ultimate counter to all heroes with projectiles, Lolita. Testing her basic attacks, these are definitely blocked. But when we tested the shield against her first and second skill, both were not blocked by the shield. I guess both are just not considered projectiles. We also tested it against the basic attacks during Ixia's ultimate skill. Here, Lolita was able to block the basic attack barrage alone. But when we tried it while having some targets behind Lolita, some projectiles were blocked while some made it through. On this first attack, all the three of them were supposed to be targeted and it was all blocked by Lolita. But on the next basic attack, one made it through while the other two were blocked. We tried multiple scenarios and we still can't figure out why others are making it past the shield. Probably what we can say is maybe the angle of the missiles vary as well to be considered if blockable or not. 
But at least we know that Lolita could block some of the missiles to defend her teammates during Ixia's ultimate skill. What do you think about these experiments? Comment down below and tell us what you think. We would like to thank our lovely lab rat, Valerie, for being our lab rat for this experiment. You can search for her in-game and tell how much you appreciate her, willing to sacrifice her pride and honor to be a test subject. Watch her in-game streams and send some flowers and hearts. Thanks for watching. Do not forget to like and share this video. Also subscribe to our channel for more contents by clicking on the subscribe button below. For our skin giveaway events, tune in on our live streams. Check our coffee link on the description of this video just in case you want to donate us some milk tea and Yakult funds. See you on the next Mobile Legends Laboratory Me. Cheers! Victory!